This video will show you the replacement procedures for the 10 micron cartridge filters at the 5 mile water treatment plant. The cartridge filters are an integral part of the treatment process provided to the water. They are located just downstream of the multimedia filters and upstream of the UV disinfection reactors. There are two types of cartridge filters in this treatment system. They differ in the size of the particles they filter out. The first cartridge filter removes particles greater than 10 micron in diameter, followed by a second filter that removes particles greater than 1 micron particle size. Most harmful microorganisms, with the exception of viruses, will not pass through the 1 micron filter. The cartridge filters will need to be replaced when the pressure difference across one of the filters exceeds between 83 and 103 kPa, 12 to 15 psi. When this happens, it means that a lot of material has accumulated on the cartridge surface, making it harder for the water to pass through. Begin by altering the water plant operating levels to ensure the plant does not start during maintenance. Close the isolation valve upstream of the 10 micron filter to stop the flow of water through the system. Close the isolation valve downstream of the 10 micron filter. Connect a hose and open the drain valve to drain the housing. Ensure it is completely drained. Loosen the wing nuts and remove the filter housing access cover. Remove the filter alignment plate. Remove the upper filter gasket. Remove the micron filters and the flow distribution tubes. Discard the used filter cartridges and place the flow distribution tubes in the sink. Using dish soap and hot water, wash the tubes, upper filter gasket, filter alignment plate, and filter housing access cover. Everything you have removed from the filter housing. Remove the lower flow distribution plate and lower filter gaskets. And wash in dish soap and hot water. Next, using dish soap and hot water, wash the interior of the filter housing. and then rinse with clean, hot water. Place the washed lower filter gaskets on the lower flow distribution plate. And install the lower flow distribution plate back into the filter housing. Insert the clean flow distribution tubes into new filter cartridges and install them onto the lower flow distribution plate inside the filter housing. Install the clean upper gasket ensuring all tubes align with the appropriate holes in the upper gasket. Refill the filter housing with chlorinated water through the flow distribution tubes. Install the clean upper flow distribution plate, again ensuring the flow distribution tubes align with the appropriate holes. Install the clean filter housing access cover and evenly tighten the wing nuts to secure. Wing nuts should only be hand tightened.
open the valve downstream of the 10 micron filter, and open the valve upstream of the 10 micron filter, reinstating water flow through the system. Set the plant operating level to normal operating settings. Compare the pressure upstream of the 10 micron filter against the pressure downstream of the 10 micron filter. Any pressure drop across the 10 micron filter should be 3 psi or less with new filters. Finally, check the filter housing access cover for leaks and wipe down the exterior. When the pressure across the filter reaches 25 psi for one minute, an alarm light in the enunciator panel will turn on and remain on until filters are replaced. The 1 micron cartridge filters may require changing more frequently than the 10 micron cartridge filters. Check the 10 micron filters each time the 1 micron filters are replaced. You have now completed the 10 micron cartridge filter replacement procedure for the 5 mile water plant. For additional information about this procedure, please see the following.